Now what we're going to cover is the formula to play any major scale on the piano. Now, I promise you, with this formula, you can do it. I promise it. I promise it. I promise it. I promise. I'm telling you. Any. And I do not. Oh, it's exact, I'm not exaggerating when I say that. Any major scale. Okay. So before we get into that, I want you to understand that every note that you see here has a scale with it. Okay. Now we all should know this, but if you don't know this, basically starting at C, you can play all the white keys all the way up to the next C. And that is the first major scale on the keyboard that we're going to talk about. But this formula is going to show you how this follows the formula and then you can play any note on here and it will follow the formula as well. Okay, so let's take a look here. Okay, that was a C major scale. Okay, so the formula is now starting at this. Let, let's explain something here. This is the first note you're going to play is the root, what they call the root. Don't ask me why they call it the root. That's just what it's called. It's the first note of the scale. And you call that note the root note. Okay. So you always play the root first and then you get into the formula. So start off with C. All right. And the formula is back to the whole steps and half steps. So check this out. You're going to make two whole steps. one half step and then make three more whole steps and then fin to finish it off you finish it off at the other root at the top of it okay so we're gonna start off with the root and you're in off with the root okay so let's go over that formula one more time the formula is starting off at the root Two whole steps, one half step, three whole steps, finish it off at the root. Start off the root, it's two whole steps, one half step, three whole steps, finish off the root. So that's the root note. Go up two whole steps. One, two, one, two, half step. Three whole steps. One, two, one, two, one, two. Stop, finish off at the root. Now, that looks extremely easy. Okay? It looks extremely easy. I'm not going to sit here and lie to you. It looks easy right now. Okay? It does. Because we're all on white keys. But what if we were to say to play a different key? Let's check it out in some other keys. All right, so what's the formula again? Starting off at the root, you're going to go up two whole steps, one half step, and three whole steps. So let's look at it and see one more time before we test this secret formula out to make sure you can play any major scale, right? We're going to test this out. So C, go up a what? Whole step, another whole step half step then three more whole steps end it off at the root now again that's all white keys so it's pretty simple alright so what if we started off at say G What if we did that? What if we started off there? What, what? How would it go then? Well, let's see if the formula works. Start off. This is the root note. Go up two whole steps. One half step. And three more whole steps. End it off at the root. You see, see what we just did? Root, 
two whole steps, half step, three more whole steps. End it off at the root. All right, so it it seemed like it's maybe all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. You know, what I'm saying it it's, it still had a lot of white keys in it. Maybe that's not as hard. Let's see. What if we hit like C sharp? All right. Let's see what we what we come off with with C sharp. This is the root. Go two whole steps up. Now that's a half step. Two whole steps. Then, then connect it with a half step. Let me get three more uh, whole steps. Finish off of the root. All right, so if you just practice going anywhere on the keyboard following this root and then if you took it a step further i mean not not roots follow this formula it took a step further and started as you played it say the note out loud so you have a recognition in your mind okay this this note is c this note is this this is this, you know you're gonna get good over time so this is where see this is this is the fundamental now you got to go take it and practice it all right this is that's that's the next assignment for you is to take this and to practice it. All right. Now that, that I'm telling you, because you can start off with your index finger first just to learn it. But then you want to get to the point where you're actually playing it. And I'll show you in some other lectures how to play it so you can kind of master it. Don't sleep on this. I'm telling you, this is this is like um, killer information right here. We can start off right here. G sharp. This is the root, all right? So we're going to go up two whole steps. One half step. Three more whole steps. Finish off at the root. <laughs> 